Yes, yes. You know, for 90 minutes, I I forgot for the for the war. It, 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 but, but I don't know. I in in after the first half, I, I sat in the locker room, and I just oh, oh we we already played 45 minutes. Very nice. I I, I didn't hear the alarm in the in the city. So yes, for 90 minutes, like. I, I turn off and, and just to play football. I enjoy to play football and uh, very good emotions, very warm emotions and all. And uh, now I'm, I'm like feel proud because of that. Uh, I, I've waited for this day, for the day since we started preparation for the championship. And uh, I, I was a little bit nervous uh, because uh, but uh, when I uh, when I heard the our anthem, when I when I saw the people, my teammates, the opponents, and uh, I I was proud of my country, and uh, I was happy that we start our uh, championship because it's important for our country and for our people. We we already have uh, have war for six months, and. Uh, not, I don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe tomorrow it will be stop. I may, but maybe it could be one year. I don't know. But I pray every day, and uh, I hope that uh, uh, my country, my and our people will win this war, and we and my family come back because my, our families come back to to our homes. It's very important. It's my dream. And I pray for this every day. We and, and the team behind this uh, who are really excellent people. You know, they've put together, uh, we've put together and uh, a sort of uh, a sort of idea that we're going to split Donbass Arena pitch into 154,000 around 154,000 individual uh, digital assets. And then, you know, when person makes a donation, they're going to receive an, an ownership basically of the pitch. So this is an idea behind behind this 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 program. And I think it's going to resonate very well with, the, with global football fans because, you know, pitch is something that every football fan adores and likes, hopefully. And that that's how this came about so we didn't want just you know to donate some for something and and then and then just give nothing so we wanted to give something back every day the first thing i guess most of the people over here do they just you know uh, click the news go to the website see the news and you know sometimes they're good sometimes they're not so much and that's that really puts pressure uh, on, on top of everybody so hopefully we will be able you know to provide a bit of a bit of an escape for under current circumstances, uh, circumstances, sure. uh, and obviously we didn't uh, we did provide a time of the game, but we didn't provide the location of the game. This was something that the military asked us to do. So uh, uh, the, these are sort of circumstances that you need to deal with. Well, the first thing obviously is uh, is you need to have a space where the players and everybody involved can go. The air raid alerts, you know, come in. So you need to have a space there. You need to ensure the facility security. So there's going to be no provocation, stuff like that. So that's normally what we do. It's not. It's not very different in terms of like normal operation, but still, uh, you know, mostly security and making sure that uh, we we fit the quota in terms of how many people actually allowed. It's about a couple hundred people, I think, two hundred or two hundred fifty people with the team with everything are allowed on the premise with security with everything. So that's very little, obviously. So these are the limitations. They actually they're very similar to uh, to COVID limitations, aside from you know from air raids and, and uh, military type of thing. We've become, uh, I think. Uh, more able to adjust, you know, to new things, to whatever comes, you know, at this point in time, I think nothing's going to surprise us in the future. I mean, from alien invasion, I guess, you know, <laughs> you know, I'm struggling to, you know, to find something which would really uh, put us on the back foot, you know, in the future. It's, a, it's, you know, everything, the worst things that could have happened, you know, they're happening. So it's a, it's a tough thing, but we, you know, we've uh, we've always tried try to stay positive and try to make most of the out of the situation. You know, so that's.